In this video, I'm going to show you how to blow up the run in Madden 22 out of the Nickel 245 Aught. What's going on guys? My name is Cody and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If this is your first time visiting my channel, be sure to click that subscribe button down below. It's completely free to subscribe to the channel. And like I said, if you're new to the channel, I just released my Nickel 245 Odd Defensive eBook. Now, if you haven't heard about it, I think this is probably the best defense in the game right now for a number of reasons. One of the reasons that I absolutely am in love with this defense is because of the pressure that it can send, but also uh, because of the alignment that you get and because of the personnel that you're able to get on the field. In the defensive ebook, we show you how to get um, safeties at every position and be able to get you know the, the most bang for your buck and the beauty of this is you still have the 335 wide that we have broken down earlier on in the season. We have a defensive ebook out on that as well. But anyways, let's talk about this 245 odd run defense. And this is something that I think people have been lacking. There's a there's two different run defenses that I want to show you today. Um, the first one is a little bit more passive, and the second one is a little bit more aggressive. So the play is pinch two. That's what we're going to come out in. Um, we have the LB cross three in our audibles, and we're going to show you how to stop the bunch inside zone. So all we're going to do is kind of back up just a little bit with this guy right here and at the snap of the ball we're going to come in and right before we get blocked we're just going to dive tackle that's all we're going to do just like that and we're going to be able to stop the run now if you wanted to spread your linebackers you could certainly do that and you'll see here that sometimes when we do that they will get a little bit better of a look but one other thing that you can do with this um, because we're facing gun bunch is you can bring these safeties down into the box just like this right here and then you're going to stand just like right in here and now you'll see we get a little bit of a cleaner shoot angle um, at that at that quarterback or at the running back. So as you see there, that's one way that we can stop inside zone. Now the second way to stop inside zone is to go to the LB cross three show two. And the reason that I like to go to this play is because this is very effective um, against really any run in the game. So all we're going to do is we're going to just put this guy right here, Williams. We're just going to put him into a zone. So you can put him in any zone of your choice. I personally prefer the mid-read zone. Um, and then I like to shade my coverage down out of this. Now, normally this guy over here would be a safety, so he's not a coverage liability. Isaiah Simmons will be fine, but, you know, your average guy, your outside linebacker, you would not want to put him in coverage. But you're going to stand right here with your user, literally right here. And what you're going to see here is if they run the ball, you're going to basically get instant interior pressure. You're either going to get the looping uh, linebacker that's rushing. He's going to come into the A-gap and, and get the guy locked down. I like to show blitz out of this look. And the reason why is just because it brings this guy into the box because that's going to be my number one user on this play. So anyway, you're just going to stand literally right here. That's all you're going to do. And just come down here just like this. And there you see the looper comes in and he's able to blow up the run. This is my favorite run defense, especially for formations that I might not know how to stop. For example, let's go to the bunch wide flex. And what you'll see here is if we go to this LB cross three show two and they run the inside zone, um, it's very likely that they're, we're going to be in an advantageous position. So again, I'm just going to literally stand like right here and at the snap of the ball, the inside zone, you see they shoot in and they stop the inside zone. So this is my favorite way to stop the shotgun runs in the game. Now, the cool part about this is you can, you can apply uh, pressure from this defense as well. For example, if I wanted to send some pressure, I'll just globally blitz my linebackers and I'll just send five. And what you'll see from this uh, real quick here is this, let me show you one more time. Let me get this set up. So again, you're gonna see this look right here. And if we get this, Again, I like to stand like right in here and the snap of the ball. What you're going to see is we should get some looping pressure right through the A gap every single time. So that's the beauty of the nickel 245 odd. Literally everything you do, no matter what play you call, you are going to have some type of, of effective pressure that you're going to be able to send at your opponent. Even if it's a run defense, you're going to be able to send pressure out of that. Uh, as you can see here, like I said, I absolutely love this defense. This is my favorite defense um, at this point in the season. The one thing I would say is if you if you press your uh, or if you base align your coverage out of this 245 odd, I find it to be just a little bit better. And then you might need to just kind of manually move this guy out, crash your line down a little bit to get a better blitz angle. This guy's not cooperating with me, but let's see if I can get him just moving out here just a little bit. There you see, that's the blitz angle we want. So then um, if they pass, then you have this amazing pressure right there. Obviously, we weren't able to get in. I think it's because I had to move him too much. But the beauty of this is that both plays that we talked about have incredible pressure. We've, we've talked about the pinch uh, the pinch two a lot here on this uh, on this uh, channel. 
it's really one of the best plays of the game because you don't have to do anything. There's no setup required, and as you see, we're going to absolutely scream off the edge. We're going to get off of one of the other edges. It it could be one or the other, but you're going to get pressure out of pinch two. Um, you don't really have to worry about that. Again, all you got to do is spread your line, show blitz, and then again, if you want to hover, you can hover right here. You can also come back out, like I said, for that inside zone. So now, if they pass the ball then I'm in a good position to be able to get crazy, crazy pressure at the quarterback. So thanks for watching this video. If you want to get my full nickel 245 odd defensive guide, there is a link in the description below. You can get the entire defense for just $15. And again, like I said, you're going to be able to find the best blitzes in the game. We literally have two-man pressure against Gun Bunch Max Protect. So that's insane on both sides too. Most people can only get this pressure to work on the left side. We're going to show you how to get it to work every bit just as good, if not honestly even a little bit better on the right side. Thanks for watching the video, and we'll see you guys next time. If you want to get the ebook, there's a link in the description. You can get it for just 15 bucks. Just click that link, take you over the website, and we'll get you all squared away.